We're talking about free radicals, antioxidants, and how this affects people with kidney disease, whether you have chronic kidney disease or acute kidney injury. This comes from the article published June in the Scientific Reports. Associations between oxidative balance score and chronic kidney disease events in US adults, a population-based study. Your body's always in a state of producing these free radicals, okay, these unpaired molecules. And when these free radicals are produced through just living your life, but when they're produced through injury, and especially disease when you have any type of disease a lot of free radicals are getting produced and these free radicals damage your organs they damage cells in your body and you can take and your body makes antioxidants to neutralize those free radicals and so this isn't new we've got thousands of studies on about oxidative stress it's called when you have these free radicals they call it oxidative stress and how it damages your body, your organs. It's generally, um, when you have a lot of it, your disease will progress faster. And unfortunately, there aren't really any medications that can address this. So that's why your doctor never addresses it. Now we do have supplements, okay, that can address this quite effectively if you use the right kinds and the right dosages. So that's this study just talked about how a lot of people with chronic kidney disease have very high oxidative stress and you can neutralize that with free radicals. So first, colorful fruits and vegetables that are kidney friendly. You definitely want to consume a lot of those in your diet. Next, you want to take some type of antioxidant supplements. Okay, you can get them through a multivitamin and, and this is just a list of some. So vitamin D, okay, excellent antioxidant which most people with kidney issues should be taking. Okay, low doses of vitamin C, and you don't have to stay on these antioxidants long term. You can go on and off of them. Something like vitamin D you may need to. Uh, vitamin E, also an excellent uh, antioxidant, at least 400 IUs, once or twice a day. Selenium, selenium, zinc, okay, these are two excellent ones that you should be taking, either in a multivitamin or separately and you know these how these antioxidants are very beneficial and a lot of herbs also have antioxidant properties to them like curcumin uh, nutraceuticals like quercetin coq10 have excellent antioxidant properties to them so look at other videos you can learn more about that but part of a full plan addressing your kidney issues should provide some type of antioxidants in there to help those free radicals so thanks for watching everybody into your best kidney health